Hey everybody, welcome back to my garage. We just finished three rounds of another crazy bodyweight workout. So why don't you warm up and join us? We have this whole workout here for you to try. You can do it right along with us um, in real time so you can see how we're all dying just like you are. But you just keep moving and try to do the best you can. You can modify movements if you need to. Uh, let us know in the comments if you try it out. Uh, please like and subscribe. We appreciate you so much. Thank you so much for watching. Enjoy. All right, starting around one. Maybe a long jump. Hand walk back. Oh. My shirt is bothering me. with my shirt. All right. Okay, air jack and gorilla sprawl. Yay. This one's fun. Animal movements. Here we go. Okay, 
Okay. Okay, that one's hard. Okay, single leg push up to a side plank. Let's go slow. With this. There we go. So starting on your stomach.
one's not so bad. Okay, here we go. Side lunge, burpee. Oh, okay. All right, here we go, guys. Push-ups. the wrong one. Okay, I'm going to keep going with this one. I did number four. All right, here we go. You guys are doing plyo push-ups. I'm kind of glad I got those push-ups over with. Push up. 
Yeah, these are hard. more seconds. I saw those dance moves, Erica. Oh. Okay. <laughs> All right, side hops, you guys. Okay, last round, you guys. Woo! All right, we got this. 
Long jump. There you go for it. Push-ups. Jacking gorilla hop. Here we go. Oh 
Okay, single leg push up. There you go. Mm. Oh. seconds. Tighten that oblique. Oh, hang in there, you guys. We're almost there. A little bit longer.
good job, you guys. If you did all three rounds, good job. Thank you for watching. Have a great day. Our first exercise is a long jump to a plank and then a hand walk back to your feet. So you're gonna start, try to jump as far as you can into a squat, hands to the floor, jump to a plank, core tight, and then keep those legs as straight as you can, walk your hands to your feet, and get ready to do another one. Exercise number two is a jump tuck to a side lunge and then down to a burpee. So you're gonna step out to the side after you do that jump tuck, push your hips back, and then stay low and just take your hands to the floor all the way down on your stomach and pop back up. And then you're gonna do the other side. It's actually easy to remember which side you're on. So you're gonna jump tuck and side lunge. You're gonna really sit back, try not to go into your knee push the hips back, weight in your heel, chest up, stay low, and then sprawl out to the floor on your stomach, and then hop back up. All right, exercise number three is three plyo push-ups. So you're gonna push off the floor and come down into a push-up, and then you're gonna pike jump three times, pulling from your core up, pull your hips up. So if you can't do those push-ups, you can drop down on. Exercise number four is a side center hop from a plank to a low squat. So you're gonna jump out to a plank, hop your feet to the side, come back to the middle, and then jump to a low squat. So you're going to feel this one a lot in your core. Exercise number five is an air jack to a gorilla sprawl. So you're going to jump up an air jack and then hop your hands first, feet follow, all the way down to your stomach. Come back and do another air jack. Hands first, feet follow, all the way down and back up. Exercise number six is a single leg push-up to a side plank with an elevated leg. So you're gonna to try to hold your leg up the whole time, which really challenges your obliques as you're coming through that transition. So you've got that leg up in the air, push-up. You're gonna keep that leg up in the air as you rotate up onto one hand and try to get that side plank. Very intense. You don't wanna to go too fast on these. Take your time. Exercise number seven is an air squat and a straight leg hamstring stretch. So you're gonna try to push your hips back, get down as low as you can, try to get your hands to the floor on that stretch and keep your chest up. Exercise number eight is a real cardio challenge. They're just little side hops. So it's like you're hopping over something quickly. And again, this works your obliques. There's a lot of obliques working in this workout today. Exercise number nine is one half burpee and one whole burpee. So you're starting on your stomach, coming to a low squat, and then coming back to your stomach and doing a full burpee. And exercise number 10, the last exercise, is a full sit up to a hip extension. So you're just gonna try to Sit all the way up, reach out in front of yourself, hands over the head, and lift your hips off the ground, squeezing your glutes, and keeping your core tight on this one also. So it actually feels really good at the end after all that. And that is it. Enjoy the workout.